the moment, we're working with the local town government of Acton to come up with a climate action plan that's basically going to be about how to get to um, net zero emissions. The district has made a deep commitment to um, energy conservation, energy efficiency, and renewable energy. One of the great joys in my position is that I get to work with students. Because all of us are really interested in making this planet just a better place, and starting locally, it's easy for us to get along, even though we have so many different ideas on the same topic. And LX is a leader in the world for sustainable strategies and empowering on the sustainable future. Our technology is state of the art and we have a lot of innovative approaches that can help earn revenue for schools and businesses. We received a $1.25 million state grant uh, which allowed this project to proceed. It's a uh, four megawatt hour battery array. So it's parked here on campus and is um, doing a number of things. It's generating revenue for Acton Boxboro. We receive a share of the revenue that the battery makes. In addition, it reduces the carbon footprint for the district by eliminating the highest peaks of what we use, and it also helps to stabilize the grid. It, it really is a start, and it's how we're going to get there. It's how we're going to get to net zero is with, you know, things like this. The students that I work with um, are remarkable. They are thinking about climate change in big ways, and not all people are capable of that. I'm 14. Like, <laughs> how much can I do except do what I'm doing now, locally, and getting this message out to everybody that renewable resources are our future. It's my future, it's my classmates' future that is really at stake here. It's Anel's mission to empower the sustainable future, and my day-to-day -day work, I think, contributes to that in a great way. For our students to be able to um, cross the parking lot and stand out here with me and look at a battery array that's actually functioning, that's actually doing demand response, and engaging with the grid is, is a whole new world for us.